If you want to make some picks on your favorite sports, check out Underdog Fantasy's Pick'em Game where you choose higher or lower on between two to eight players and can win up to 325 times your entry. And using code ZERK when you sign up, you'll get up to $1,000 in bonus cash and a free pick. The whole thing wobbing. Today, guys, we're going to talk about the cheapest way to get training points in Madden 25 Ultimate Team. I do want to give a shout out to the popular loner for being a part of the Noti Gang. If you guys want a chance to shout out the next video, drop a like in the vid. Make sure you guys are subbed to the channel. Turn notification bell on and comment down below. Noti Gang. Also, you guys happen to this upcoming Monday to use one of the four NFL Week 1 discounts specially available right now on Underdog. We also have college football tomorrow, which I'm extremely excited about. I have picks up right now over my Twitter. I will have more, and I believe we may even be seeing some payout booster specials or some sort of other specials today. And if you guys check out Underdog Fantasy right now using code ZERK, you'll get up to $1,000 in bonus funds and a free pick when you guys sign up. And only when you sign up using code ZERK will you also get this Dak Prescott 0.5 passing yard special. All right, guys, so number one, let's talk about what do you need training points for? Because a lot of people have been asking me about training points. If you guys don't know, uh, when it comes to training points, there's a couple of different things you can use them on. Of course, if you don't know this already, abilities, you do need training points, put abilities on your players. As you guys can see, these do cost you 100 training, 100 training, 100 training. Uh, and then, of course, as we get farther on into the year, you're going to be able to not only put X factors, but also abilities on cards, which you already can do with some cards like Max Crosby right here. You can see you can actually throw on an ability onto him. Uh, but all of these right here are free. I would imagine as we continue on in the year, you're going to have to actually start paying to put abilities on there per usual. And then, of course, the X factor, as I already mentioned. That's one thing you actually need training points for. The other thing, and I think the main reason why you guys wanted this video, is these right here. Mystery packs. Now, mystery Mystery packs are only actually in the game now for, by the time you guys are watching this video, about like 24 hours, and then they're going to be going away. However, I would be shocked if they didn't come back back perhaps maybe at a more expensive price if they're waiting to kind of update that whatever also we do have a bunch of other training packs that we get throughout the entire year uh and mystery packs i know people want to go ahead and rip these open uh, as you can see though they are 90 training points so even myself i didn't even know really how expensive these packs were now what exactly does 90 training points even cost you well we're gonna go ahead and run through the cheapest way to get training points in madden 25 which if you don't know the way to get training points in general it's literally just quick selling cards with that being said though there are currently six overalls above 80 that is anyways uh the new quick sell for training you could go out there and potentially like look at you know lower overalls than that but it's just not worth your time for the amount of training points you're gonna get so 80 through 85 overalls keep in mind only normal okay normal cards not platinums platinums quick sell for coins so when i talk about the cheapest i was able to find specific overalls for because i'm going to run through 80 through 85 so you guys kind of get an idea on the cheapest ones and you also want to take a look at the auction house depending on the time i will tell you right now i'm recording this video at 11 p.m at night obviously if you guys are on during you know thursday 1 30 if you're on saturday with legends at 10 30 the auction house is going to be a lot more lively and that's when you want to buy training points getting into it though guys 80 overalls now again this is not the cheapest one that i was able to find right here but the cheapest 80 overall that i was actually able to find was 17,187 coins and i do want to tell you guys this uh when it comes to buying training points you want to filter by overall right 80 to 81 and then you want to go down now, what i like to do is filter by all offense and all defense because doing this you're going to be able to see what position you might want to target but then you want to go down even more to the actual position right so if i filter by fullback well, now I can see one right there for 19,437. But the absolute lowest you're going to be able to find any 80 overalls in the auction house for is 17,187 coins, uh, which I was able to when I was looking. And they quick sell for 110 training points. Now, that would be 156 point two four five coins per training point okay and normally i would just put like 156.25 i would actually just round up there there's a reason why i went into specifics with that 156.245 coins per training point if you buy an 80 overall at their price floor and the reason why i went into so specific there is because with 81 overalls guys this one actually is i do believe at the price floor for 81s uh the cheapest that i was able to find was a card just like this for 26,562 coins now 81s quick sell for a little bit more 170 training points so 81 overalls if you were to buy them and quick sell them you are spending 156.247 coins per 
just ever so slightly more so currently as this very second 80 overalls are a better value than 81s but it is very fractional in that regard so 80 overalls 81 overalls they're very similar 82 overalls as of right now guys they do quick sell for 270 training points the cheapest 82 overall that i was able to find uh is 56,437 coins and that is 209.025 coins that you are spending to get an 82 overall quick sell so yeah don't buy 82s right now and as for 83 overalls they quick sell for 430 training the cheapest 83 overall that i was able to find right now in the auction house uh, was 71,500 coins i looked through a bunch of different positions to try to find that and that was the lowest that i could find uh that is 166 0.28 coins per training point that's actually pretty close to 80s and 81s but you're still spending about 10 more coins per training point if you buy 83s over 80s or 81s and then we have 84s and 85 overalls guys uh, again once we go higher up in overalls once like we get a you know overall escalation we go up to like 86 overall champions training will get a little bit cheaper because odds are ea is going to drop the uh the floor right the price floor on like 80s 81s whatever and uh pack odds increase the market will constantly change so i will update this video all year long for you guys but 84 overall is the quick sell for 680 training points the cheapest one i was able to find was 151,250 coins which is 222.43 coins per the worst ratio currently available don't buy 84s or i should say sell 84s don't quick sell them and as for 85 overalls guys they quick sell for 1080 training the cheapest one that i was able to find was 175,000 coins and that is 162.04 coins per it's actually pretty good that's actually one of the better values but overall guys if you're looking to get training points right now uh and then again the reason i went through all of them there so you personally can know that and if you happen to find 85 overalls for much cheaper well then you could go ahead and scoop up an 85 overall and get it a good value uh but 80s and 81s right now yeah those are the best to go ahead and get if you can get 80 overalls for their price floor at 17,187 coins or if you can get 81 overalls from 26,562 coins which i do believe is their floor as well they're extremely similar they're 156 coins per training point that you're spending and that is the cheapest training currently actually guys i just remember we do have an 87 that quick sells for training points and that's of course 87 overall miles garrett uh we don't have 86s the nico collins and montez sweat yeah nico and sweat they don't they quick sell for 400,000 coins uh miles garrett though yeah he's very expensive he quick sells for 2700 training points so at his current price of 915,000 coins that's 338 coins per training point that's just awful now with that being said right 156 coins per training point so what does that mean well for a mystery pack right here right number one you take a look at the packs are in here uh it's a 70 plus overall player ace fantasy pack rushing pack boom pack core elite ultimate preseason pack or legend pack well just so you guys know when it comes to these other packs that it's talking about it, it was just a regular i think just a regular legend pack right yeah yeah legend pack so a legend pack right here costs eighty six thousand coins a boom pack is 45k i don't believe that we have the elite packs anymore in the store they are now gone i believe they were around 70k i want to say around 70k well right now guys for every single mystery pack that you open if you go out and buy 80 and 81 overalls for those prices that i told you about you're spending fourteen thousand coins basically to do this pack so honestly 14,000 coins for a mystery pack does not sound all that bad and i will tell you guys right now as you get a 70 plus overall player uh in madden 24 okay mystery packs compared to the value that you were uh, having to go ahead and buy training points for they always came out to around like 30,000 coins they always came out to around 30,000 coins so right now you're actually getting it for like half the price that these packs actually were in madden 24 given they had other packs in them too and maybe you know that's what ea is kind of calculating there but if you're spending 14,000 coins per right and you open up any of these packs and you get an 80 overall everything else out of that pack is going to be straight profit as here we don't really get too much you know we get a 76 overall 74 overall evan neal right there we'll do like two more packs whatever but that's the cheapest way to get training points uh, as i said these have a timer on them so if you want to go out there take advantage of this now get some 80s get some 81s come in here open up some mystery packs and see if you can get a little bit lucky or if you want to wait to use the training points I, in my personal opinion by the way 
don't go out and stock up on training because again overall increases price floors go down training is going to fluctuate and it always fluctuates a lot i seriously would not recommend you have more than whatever you need at the very moment to be honest with you uh just to have sitting there in training points as we do get an elite right here really 77 randy moss and we get that animation thank you uh thank you very much ea really appreciate that one but with that being said guys i hope you did enjoy the video and if you did make sure to drop a like video and of course hit that sub button down below make sure to check out underdog fantasy use code zerk college football tomorrow extremely extremely excited for that and you guys have all the way up until nfl week one to sign up using code zerk to get that dak prescott exclusive special if you guys enjoyed this video check out these